Hi guys, in this video, I'll show you how to get started with the PPOM plugin. So once you've installed and activated PPOM, you can now configure its settings. So let's hover over WooCommerce on the left, then click on PPOM fields. And now I'll click on add PPOM meta group. Now we need to add a meta group name. We can call it shirts. Now let's select how the price will be displayed on the product page. So I'll select show only options total. For our example, we can leave the apply for categories field empty. Let's click add field. And now at the top, let's click text input. So the first thing we need to do here is add a title. I'll call this t-shirt text. And now I'll add a description. So I'll type in enter text here. So that's good. And if you need to, you can fill out the other fields if they apply to your use case. Now I'll click on add field at the bottom and I'll click add field again, this time in the bottom left. Now I'll go ahead and click on select input. And now we need to add a title again. So I'll type in, would you like it gift wrapped? So that's good so far. And you can fill out the other fields if you need to. Now I'll click on the add options tab. These options will be yes or no. So I'll start with yes. And for the price, I'll set this to five. And for me, that's dollars and weight and stock information requires the pro version. We don't need these for our example. So let's click on plus. Now we can remove the yes and replace it with no. And the price for this one will be zero. And now we can click on add field. Let's move to the bottom of this page and click save fields. So now we need to add these fields to a product. So I'll open up all products. Let's use this one, test T. Now we can scroll to the product data section. Let's click PPOM. If we access this menu, we can see all of our PPOM fields. Let's use shirts. So let's go ahead and click on the update button. And from there, we can now click on this view product link. So here's our example product. We can see the price, which is $45. And here's the field where we can enter our t-shirt text. So I'll type life is good as an example. And here's the other input we configured. Would you like it gift wrapped? Yes adds $5 to the cost and no keeps it at the same price since its value is zero. And here's the cost breakdown. Now we can purchase this product. So let's view our cart, scroll down, proceed to checkout. And now we can place the order. So now you'll notice that the value for the PPOM fields show up in the order details as well. So we have the t-shirt text that was entered as well as the response to the gift wrap option. Okay, so I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching.